Hi, okay, it's me, Jessica King, and I'm working in the studio here. Uh, I have uh, some new pieces. This is some of the fabric that Tony gave me from 20th Century Fox. Uh, so once again, this was used in movies and TVs for 20th Century Fox. Um, I'm gonna feature this painting I got printed onto fabric. I'm not sure how I'm gonna use this, but I am gonna use this for this new, this doll. I did this painting maybe like six years ago. Um, yeah, and then we have, so I'm gonna do furry ears and skinny legs. Hopefully they come out. Sometimes skinny legs are hard to do. Okay, wish me luck everyone. Bye. <laughs> This is Richard Ramirez, and these are my top 10 Jallo films. I'm a huge fan of Italian Jallo films, and these are my top 10 favorites, including Four Flies on Gray Velvet, The Bird with the Crystal Plumage, Tenebre, Torso, The Corruption of Chris Miller, The Black Belly of the Tarantula, Death Carries a Cane, Hotel Fear, so sweet, so dead, and orgasmo. These are some of my favorites and I highly recommend giving them a watch. And also this Umberto Lindsay and Carol Baker box set by Severin is definitely a must have. Here she is screaming Mimi. Ah! If you like her, check her out on Etsy. Link description down below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and join us on Patreon. Hello, this is Colin, and today's tea is Merlin's Magic. And I'm going to continue talking about the early days of tea in England. In 1660, Thomas Garway opened the first tea shop in London. And of course, tea at this time was still quite expensive, so of course it pays to advertise. And uh, this, in part, I'm going to quote from a broadsheet that Garway published at the time about tea that the virtues and excellencies of this leaf and drink are many and great, it is evident, and manifest by the high esteem, and the use of it, especially in late years, among the physicians and knowing men in France, Italy, Holland, and other parts of Christendom. Not to mention China. Um, Please consider supporting our channel by joining us at Patreon.